I'm looking at my mom as a superhero because she was holding the house down. Right. What I'm doing as far as holding myself down and being an alpha female, which I didn't ask to be, right. is protecting myself mm-hmm. and protecting my kids. And if I even jump into a relationship, I'm still holding now. What you're doing is just self-destruct, period. So, of course, you can't use it as an excuse. Mine isn't an excuse. It's just what I had to do. When you say it's not self-destructive, you're right. But it's destructive to your relationship. When you run into a man and he has to climb a barbed wire fence before you trust him to lead because of your upbringing. See, and, and let's just be honest here. If you run into a guy who's actually solid and he had, comes in with structure and the plan and the, everything that we get to talk about, women don't just, okay, you know what, you can you can have it. Regardless of what he's showing her, he's showing her he's a great dude. Still, she has to get over said programming. That uh, she was a kid And that's what I mean by You may not be self-destructive True Right But you're destructive to the relationship The alpha woman Has problems The alpha woman has a power complex This is what destroys her relationships This is what an alpha woman is A woman with a power complex A female version of a narcissist They cannot let somebody else do it they don't want to allow someone else to lead they'll use excuses and their own experience just to be in control just to have the last say just to get what they want and because they've been able to replicate this in their career they'll expect to have the same effect in their relationships the woman even with the career doesn't have a problem letting a man lead or having control or power the alpha woman does though the alpha woman has a problem with letting go of her power which she has worked hard to have they view their moms as superhuman or superwoman but in reality this is actually absurd and it actually doesn't really make sense because a superhuman or superwoman means they've reached their full potential at its max. They're strong, they're naturally fit, they've reached different levels and they're 100% and now they're like 150% on top of that. The single mom or the moms that did it by themselves, they haven't reached 100% because they're single moms. You can't reach 100% when you're crippled with both legs and you're doing something that you are actually incapable of doing. So to me, they think they've seen full potential. They think they've seen powers at its highest because they're doing things that they're not supposed to. And it's never attained nor reached The full power they were supposed to have as a woman, the full power they were supposed to have as a mother, is actually never seen. So they can't actually comprehend it. This is just another way of their brain telling themselves that this is normal. This is themselves telling their brain that whatever traumatic experience I'm feeling now, this is what comes with it when you have a super mom and a superhuman by your side. And a lot of these females grow up thinking this, that there's power in doing things alone as a female. There's power in that. When in actuality, it's the complete opposite. It actually highlights how much power you lack within the household and as a woman yourself. And a lot of times these females have been fooled to thinking what a super woman actually looks like. That is not realistic in this world. So the alpha woman has been spoken about a lot of times and has been broken down in a lot of different ways. But really the alpha woman has real psychological problems that she can't seem to want to let go of because it's her problems that she was able to use to uplift herself and make herself feel better it was those problems that she was able to use to make herself feel better when she saw her mom go through those same problems that she is enduring now 
so a lot of times alpha women are just results of them lacking understanding of femininity womanhood lacking a father figure in their life lacking a lot of things that they don't want to put back in place because they think now that without it is what helped them exceed when actually it pulled them down let me know what you think thank you for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye